All right, so there's a new viral video going around of a fake gunner walking around in Atlanta Mall. Now, I cannot confirm what mall this is. I've seen some people say perimeter. It kind of also looks like Saks Fifth um, or Fifth Plaza. I don't really know. I can't tell. But regardless of the fact that YouTuber has not been identified, but what's funny about the video is just how everybody is just kind of following him and following him around and just like yelling and saying Ghana and calling him a rat and all of this different type of junk, man. And, you know... I just kind of find it funny too that y'all putting so much energy and just making this dude's life hell man at the end of the day y'all still probably listening to his music but as soon as you see him you're gonna be like oh, i don't fuck with him man. like man stop. cut the cap bro cut the cap kind of still makes great music and at the end or still or was making great music and y'all not gonna all of a sudden stop listening to it just because this man may or may not have told now at the end of the day again we still don't know if he actually told or not ysl members don't necessarily know if he told or not young thug cannot confirm if he actually told or not because all of that shit is going to just make Young Thug's case even harder so nobody can really say for sure unless y'all actually in that courtroom unless you are actually talking to young thug and he is saying from his mouth yeah buddy is a snitch shut y'all asses up it really just that simple it's it really just that simple because all you're gonna end up doing is if i'm not saying that young thug has this super elaborate master plan ass shit going on i'm not saying that but all i'm saying is if it comes to find out that young thug actually has no beef with gunner and he beats this case and they back cool again a lot of y'all gotta eat crow Meat Mill, all of y'all, Lil Dirk, all you niggas that was unfollowing and making disses and talking shit, Lil Baby, all you guys, y'all got to eat that shit. Now y'all got to eat it. That's why you better off just shutting the fuck up and just letting this shit play out. Now, I personally think Young Thug is gone. I don't think he's coming back. I Like I said, Ricos have like a 90 some conviction rate. They wouldn't have went after him unless they knew that they could book him. Now, a lot of his, a lot of the shit that they wanted him on got thrown out but for the main the main shit he's got to beat like three things or, or several different things and i don't know if he's going to beat all of them so even if he doesn't go away for life if he gets hit for any one of them hoes he's going to see 20 years 20 and by then maybe he can come out and say yeah fuck gonna fuck this dude fuck that dude yeah da, 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 da. you know what i'm saying but until then i'm just interested to see how this is going to play out because the way y'all acting Boy, if I was gonna, I wouldn't, I wouldn't rock with none of you again if it comes to find out that he didn't do it. So we'll see what happens.